Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and hit the bell icon. B and B spoilers weekly update. Blindsided and a brawl. Tune in to find out about all the drama happening in Los Angeles. B and B spoilers weekly update for February 19 to 23 tease that the week ahead is full of moments that blindside and a massive brawl. Tune in next week so you can catch all of the action in Los Angeles. Lie. Naomi Matsuda and Poppy Romy Park argued over Poppy's life choices. Luna. Lisa Yamada woke up in Zend's Delen de Metz, bed to find her life had turned upside down. Send and Luna talked about their shared night together. Poppy was stunned to learn that Luna had slept with Zend. Brooke, Catherine Kelly Lang, assured RJ Joshua Hoffman of Luna's commitment. Poppy realized she may have been responsible for Luna's unexpected actions when she slept with Zend. Luna couldn't believe that her mother's special mints were why she cheated on RJ, and she wasn't happy. Eric John McCook offered Zend a new opportunity. Zenda was shocked when Poppy and Luna confessed what had happened. Luna faced an unbearable choice, and Poppy and Zend urged her not to tell RG what happened. Coming up, Sheila Kimberlyn Brown lurks as Hope Annika Noel pleads for Deacon Seen Cannon to end things with her. Luna is blindsided by Zend's pitch for a future together. Sheila approaches Kelly while she's on a playdate with a friend, Steffi, Jacqueline Missinswood, and Sheila's argument gets physical fast. Finn, Tanner Novlen, and Deacon break up Sheila and Steffi's brawl. Unaware of her secret, RJ consoles a troubled Luna. Sheila lurks as Hope pleads for Deacon to end things with her. Thomas and Hope get passionate at work. Luna is blindsided by Zen's pitch for a future together. Sheila approaches Kelly while she's on a playdate with a friend. Steffi and Liam unite in their concern over Sheila. Steffi and Sheila's argument gets physical fast. Finn and Deacon break up Sheila and Steffi's brawl. Deacon worries about Sheila's current state of mind. In the heart of Los Angeles, where glamour and intrigue intertwine, the Forrester and Logan families continue to navigate the tumultuous waters of love, betrayal, and ambition. This week on The Bold and the Beautiful Tensions Soar, Alliances shift, and secrets threaten to unravel as blindsides rock the foundation of relationships, culminating in a dramatic brawl that leaves lives forever changed. As the sun rises over the iconic skyline, the Forester's fashion empire stands as a beacon of success. At Forester Creations, tensions simmer between the formidable matriarch, Stephanie Forrester, and her determined granddaughter, Steffi. Stephanie, with her steely resolve and unyielding vision for the company, finds herself at odds with Steffi's desire to modernize and innovate. Their clashes reach a boiling point when Steffi unveils her latest collection, challenging the traditional Forrester aesthetic with bold, avant-garde designs. Meanwhile, across town at the Logan estate, matriarch Brooke Logan grapples with her own inner turmoil. Haunted by the ghosts of her past, Brooke struggles to maintain the facade of perfection while battling her demons. As whispers of scandal threaten to tarnish her family's reputation, Brooke finds solace in the arms of her ex-husband, Ridge Forrester, igniting a forbidden passion that could spell disaster for them both. Amidst the chaos, secrets lurk in the shadows, waiting to be exposed. At the center of the storm is Quinn Fuller, whose manipulative schemes have left a trail of destruction in her wake. With her marriage to Eric Forrester hanging by a thread, Quinn resorts to desperate measures to hold on to power, even if it means betraying those closest to her. As the week unfolds, alliances are tested, loyalties are questioned, and the stage is set for a showdown unlike any other. It begins innocently enough, with a chance encounter between rivals at the Forrester mansion, but when simmering tensions erupt into a full-blown brawl, the consequences are far-reaching and irreversible. Fists fly, accusations are hurled, and long-buried resentments bubble to the surface as the Foresters and Logans face off in a battle for supremacy. In the heat of the moment, alliances shift, allegiances are betrayed, and the lines between friend and foe blur beyond recognition. Caught in the crossfire are the innocent bystanders, whose lives are forever altered by the fallout. Hearts are broken, dreams are shattered, and the fabric of the tight-knit community is torn asunder. But amidst the chaos and destruction, glimmers of hope emerge. 
for in the aftermath of the brawl, old wounds begin to heal, and unlikely alliances are forged in the crucible of adversity. As the dust settles, the residents of Los Angeles come to realize that it is only through love, forgiveness, and understanding that they can truly find redemption. And so, as the sun sets on another tumultuous week in the world of the bold and the beautiful, the stage is set for new beginnings and fresh challenges. For in the world of high fashion and high drama, one thing is certain, nothing is ever as it seems, and the only constant is change. As viewers eagerly await the next twist in the saga, one thing is certain, they will be on the edge of their seats, eagerly anticipating the next chapter in the epic tale of love, betrayal, and redemption. For in the world of the bold and the beautiful, anything can happen, and everything is fair game. B and B spoilers. Sheila gets an earful when Hope blasts Deacon. Hope still has big problems with her dad's love life. On the February 19 episode of The Bold and the Beautiful, spoilers tease an eventful day for Sheila and Deacon as objections to their romance return to the forefront. It's been a while since Deacon seen canon and Sheila's Kimberlyn Brown controversial relationship has been at the forefront, but they're back and it looks like the more things change, the more they stay the same. Deacon and Sheila might be happily engaged and running an Italian restaurant, but the people around them still don't want them together, and that includes Deacon's daughter, Hope, Annika Noel. In fact, Hope has some words with her dad as she once again demands that he break things off with Sheila. Too bad she doesn't notice Sheila lurking in the background taking it all in. She doesn't like what she hears, but will Hope end up paying the price? Maybe Hope will think about the fact that she is also with someone with a checkered past, but not nearly as checkered as Sheila's. As Luna, Lisa Yamada, debates whether to tell RJ, Joshua Hoffman, what really happened with Zend, Delen Demetz, and why RJ can't imagine why Luna seems so distraught. Everything was going great, and now she looks like her entire world is about to fall apart. RJ does his best to comfort his girlfriend, but it's to no avail. Luna is beside herself, but also can't bring herself to tell the truth. How can she ruin what she has with RJ by telling him she slept with Zende, but how can she also keep this a secret? Will Luna finally decide honesty is the best policy although Zend and Poppy, Romy Park, are telling her it's not? And how will RJ react when he learns the whole truth? Will he be understanding or will it destroy his new relationship? In the quaint town of Los Angeles, nestled amidst the sun-kissed hills and the shimmering coastline, Drama often brewed like a tempest within a teacup, and within the cozy confines of the Forrester Mansion, where opulence met with tangled relationships, there was never a dull moment. Today the air was charged with tension, crackling like electricity waiting to strike. Sheila Carter, a woman with a notorious reputation, had recently re-entered the lives of the Forrester family like a hurricane crashing through the calm. Her presence was always a harbinger of chaos, and today was no exception. With her piercing gaze and a smile that concealed more than it revealed, she prowled through the mansion's halls like a predator on the hunt. Meanwhile, Hope Logan, the epitome of elegance and grace, paced the living room with a storm brewing in her eyes. She was a woman pushed to her limits, her patience stretched thin like a fraying rope. Her relationship with Deacon Sharp, a man with a troubled past, had been a source of constant strain, and today she was determined to confront the demons that lurked within. As Hope's footsteps echoed through the room, Sheila emerged from the shadows like a ghost from the past. Her presence alone was enough to send shivers down anyone's spine, but Hope stood her ground, her chin held high with determination. You, Hope spat the word like venom, her gaze locking onto Sheila's. You've caused enough trouble already. What do you want now? Sheila's lips curled into a smirk, her eyes glinting with mischief. Oh dear Hope, she purred, her voice dripping with honeyed malice. I'm just here to watch the show. And my, what a show it promises to be. Hope's fists clenched at her sides, her resolve hardening like steel. She refused to let Shayla's mind games unravel her composure. You won't get away with this, she growled, her voice low and dangerous. Not this time. But before Hope could say another word, the sound of footsteps echoed through the mansion's halls, signaling Deacon's arrival. His presence was like a dark cloud looming over the room, casting a shadow of uncertainty over everything. Hope. Deacon's voice was tinged with concern as he entered the room, 
his eyes scanning the scene before him. What's going on? Why do I feel like I've walked into a lion's den? Hope turned to face Deacon, her eyes blazing with fury. Don't you dare play innocent, Deacon, she seethed, her voice trembling with barely contained rage. Sheila's been whispering poison into your ear, poisoning your mind against me. Deacon's brow furrowed in confusion, his gaze flickering between Hope and Sheila. What are you talking about? he asked, his voice tinged with disbelief. Sheila wouldn't do something like that. But Hope wasn't about to back down, not this time. She had spent far too long tiptoeing around Deacon's fragile ego, and she refused to let Sheila's manipulations tear them apart. Sheila is a master manipulator. Hope's words were like daggers, cutting through the tension-filled air with precision. She's been orchestrating this whole thing from the beginning, pulling the strings behind the scenes. Sheila's laughter rang out like a discordant melody, her eyes dancing with amusement. Oh, how delightful, she cooed, her voice dripping with sarcasm. To think that you actually believe such nonsense. But then again, you always did have a vivid imagination, Hope. Hope's jaw tightened at Sheila's words, her resolve hardening like steel. She refused to let Sheila get under her skin, to unravel her carefully constructed facade. She would fight tooth and nail to protect what was hers, even if it meant facing the demons of her past head-on. I won't let you destroy us, Sheila. Hope's voice was like a vow, her eyes blazing with determination. I won't let you win. And with those words hanging in the air like a challenge, the tension in the room reached a fever pitch. The stage was set for a showdown unlike any other, where alliances would be tested and loyalties would be questioned. In the battle between light and darkness, hope would reign supreme, but only time would tell if it would be enough to vanquish the shadows that lurked within.